hi guys welcome back to my youtube channel or hello if you are new so we are going to be doing my summer project use it up we are going to be doing a little update of where i left off for things that i've used since my last update and then what i'm going to be cycling in and taking out so there are a couple of things that I did finish, some things that are really, really close to being finished, and just some things that I'm tired of and want to get out of this rotation. So I did get a little bit bored in this rotation. Some smells ended up making me really sick. Um, you know, my smell has changed. So some of these things that I used to be obsessed with, I am not obsessed with anymore, which kind of, you know, hurts a little bit. But maybe after this pregnancy next summer, I can go ahead and give them a go again. So let's go ahead and get started. So we will start with, ooh, really close. Here, let me back you guys up a little bit. Okay, so we will start with the things that we did last month. I'll show you actually two things that I did finish. One of them will be the champagne apple and honey. This is the body lotion and this I cannot get out. I have tried so hard and fought with this bottle. So I did finish it up. I started with maybe like one to two uses left, used them up and now we're all done. So very proud of that. I really do like this. I do have more champagne apple and honey. That's another reason why I wanted to finish this up. So I'm excited to use what other products of champagne apple and honey I do have for the fall time. But this is just something that was lingering around. That's going to Mandy's. Another thing that I do have is the Happy Halloween. This is the Vampire Blood Diamond Shimmer Mist. So I finished this all up. I don't know if I'm going to add another shimmer mist to my project as of right now. I think I'm just going to continue to go with the things that I have. Maybe in my fall project choose it up, we'll have some fun and play around with some glitter. But as of right now, we did finish this one. So this is where we started last project. This is it's completely gone. but. This is where we started overall. So took two projects to fully use this up. And this is in the scent Vampire Blood. So two things that are almost done. So I have the Denim and Daisies set. I actually have very little left of the spray that I've been using like on my pillows and on my sheets and on my laundry. So... This is where we started last project. This is where we're at. Isn't that crazy? I have made so much use out of this since our last project. And then I did, I have the body cream here. I did cut her up, but she has probably like one use in there. I just was trying to also work on other things, but I wanted to do another update. So this has Sweet Daisies Sun Soaked Denim in Summer Citrus. So these are going to continue to stay in my project until I use them up. Um, hopefully this takes like a week, less than a week. And then I do have some other things that are just one-offs. My bag moved and I don't know why, that was a little weird. But anyway. These are just some things that are one-offs that need to be cut up and I have like one to two uses left out of these as well. These are both some of the body creams. So I have Fresh Getaway. We started here and then we ended here. I do need to cut this up so that way I can kind of like get my full use out of it. This has Bright Yuzu Citrus and Fresh and Chenier. I do have a backup of this so this is another reason why I'm trying to get this one used up then I have wrapped in sunshine same thing here I didn't mark it but it's like right here so she needs to be cut up 
um, you do have the spray in here as well. This is Golden Citrus White Peach in Blonde Woods. This is the only one that I have, but unfortunately I haven't seen them bring it back, so I'm just going to get rid of her. And then for the Fragrance Mist, we started up here and now we're down here. Um, so after I finish with my denim, denim and daisies, this will be my pillow mist and all that other fun stuff. So yeah, I really do like this. It's not just good for fall, but it's also for me because it's like a sweet citrusy kind of scent. It's good for all year round. So again, this has golden citrus, white peach, and blonde woods. So I really do like this one. I really do hope they bring this back, but this is getting a little bit older. I got this in 2020 one yeah that's a one 2021 when i first started so a little sad i will also be keeping these in my collection as well as this one they're both staying until i finish this up and then i also have bubbly rose as well this one needs to be cut up too um these are just things that i use at night time to try to use these up but this is a pink sparkling rose sweet blood orange and a splash of cranberry this is another one that i have a backup of so i really would like to get this used up but yeah this also needs to be cut up and then we're gonna just jump right into the rest of this so i will start with things that i will be taking out of my project use it up so this is the Pride. Pride month is over, but I am going to be taking this out and savoring this for next year. I do have quite another few Pride products, but this I feel like is very neutral scent as well. This has Sunny Sangria, Bright Melon, and Misty Water. So I feel like this is something that you can use again all year round. So it might make its way back into my, you know, project use it up at some point because I do have another cream of a different scent but I really did enjoy this I did make a good use out of this so especially the cream I feel like I got a good chunk out of here so yep we are going to be taking that out I'm gonna put this in a separate little pile so Another thing that I'm going to be taking out is Disco Daydreams. So this is not something that I wanted to fully use up, but it's something that I wanted to try and make a dent on, which I definitely did. I really do love this fragrance. Um, so eventually it might make its way back into my project, but this is where we started with the spray. This is where we ended. This has Cali Days Vanilla and Radiant Coconut. I don't really get a lot of coconut in here, but this was really nice. Again, the cream was never used. And then so we made like a good dent, like maybe a third or a fourth way through the bottle, which I'm really impressed with. So, and again, I love this. This is my favorite color and that's probably why I ended up grabbing this. But I do have something else that I'm going to substitute it for. That's kind of like the same thing just to use it not to fully use it up so i did enjoy this but she's gonna go back into my collection for a little bit okay another thing that i am taking out just for i want to say a little bit so i can use some other coconuts in my collection is going to be wakiki beach coconut i did actually enjoy this which is funny because i'm not a super coconut person so I've always been deterred from this scent but I bought it just to keep it in my collection and I actually really do like this um so I used a little bit of it quite a few um and then I made a dent with the fragrance mist so this has tropical white coconut saltwater breezes in sun bleached woods I'm going to switch this out for another coconut. Maybe in August, this will make its way back in um, as I introduce some other scents into my collection, but I really do like that one. 
Something else that's leaving is the one that's actually making me really nauseous, which is really sad, is the Pink Pineapple Sunrise. I have had this one for a while now. I believe I got this in 2022. This is the original packaging that launched, and I do have quite a few backups of this. But as of right now, it is kind of making me a little bit nauseous when I wear it. I don't know if it's because it's too sweet. But this is Sweet Pink Pineapple Palm Sugar and Sun Drenched Nectar. So I am going to be taking that out. Now, these are some of the things that I am going to be keeping in this rotation, which would be the lease. This is getting to be on the older side. This I got from MOS, but this is from 2021. So this has Banana Daiquiri, Juicy Pineapple, and Golden Sands. I have the cream and the mist. So I actually did also make quite a dent on this one. I really enjoyed this. And so a goal of mine is to actually work through it and almost complete it, if not fully complete it in the next rotation or two. I really do like the packaging. This is a very sought out fragrance too. So but she is getting a little bit old. So I did also use quite a few sprays as well. We're keeping this one into the, that right there. Um, another thing is that I'm keeping is Bahama Passion Fruit and Banana Flower. For some reason, this didn't make me as sick as the pineapple one. So I would like to get a little bit more use out of this one. I've had this spray for a while now. So I think I got this from MLS, but I did get this for myself in 2022. So this has passion fruit, pineapple leaves, and banana flower. So we did kind of make a little bit of progress on here. I think I was more focused on other things than I was this one, but we did make also some progress on the spray. So I would say we're almost halfway through the spray. And then another one that I have in here that is going to stay is the pink watermelon. I do feel like we need a good watermelon scent and I believe this is one that I'm just going to try to use up as much as possible because I do have quite a few watermelon scents in my collection. This has juicy watermelon, pink petals, and dewy aloe. It says juicy watermelon sweetens the summer day. So this is our progress on the lotion. I feel like we made some pretty good progress and then same thing with the spray I also feel like we made a lot of progress so that is another one so I will also be going to share everything that I am going to transition into this collection so I'm going to put these little guys back oh also this body butter I think I used this literally once in this whole entire month so that is another thing that I am going to try to work on. I'm going to try to finish off those little creams and then we are going to go in with this guy and get this used up. This is bigger than my other body butters that I have. This is eight ounces and I think the other ones are like five ounces. So there's quite a lot more product in here than there is in the other ones. So that is also staying in my rotation. And then I have a little bag of all these other goodies that I am bringing into my collection. Oh, I have to be careful with this one. One of my fragrance mists are leaking, unfortunately, so she needs to get used up. But we have this whole big bag over here. So that was a lot to carry. <laughs> There is a lot in here. So one thing that we'll get started with is actually another thing that I will be adding into my collection that I need to get used up. I don't know if you can hear, but that is not a good sign. That means my body cream is about to hit the dust. This is also from 2021. Again, I really wish they would bring this back. This is one of my favorite fragrances, especially for like summer transitioning into fall so this is golden clementine and amber they really need to bring this back 
This is just one of my favorite scents. This is Juicy Citrus, Sparkling Pomegranate, and Warm Amber. We need to sign a petition to get this back. This is just one of my favorite scents. It's sophisticated. It's like got this sweetness in there. It's nice. It's citrusy. It's pretty. I just, I wish they would bring it back. So now we're going to kind of dive into more of my summery fragrances. So the first one that I have is um, Bali. This is the Black Coconut Sands. I have the body cream and also the fragrance mist. So the fragrance mist is actually leaking. So it was actually pretty full, but now it's a little halfway. So that is something we're going to be using up. This is taking over for my Waikiki Beach Coconut. So let's see, this has coconut milk, sea salt musk, and black sands. I really do like this one. Again, she's getting old, so we gotta use her up. This is from 2020, so yeah, definitely a little on the older side. All right, now we have something a little bit sweeter going into my collection. Hopefully this will not make me super nauseous. I did spray a little bit of the spray on and I really do like this. This is strawberry soda. So this is, I don't really think I've used this. I bought this a while back at a different semi-annual sale in 2022. Um, I just haven't used it. I don't know why, but revisiting it this summer semi-annual sale, I was like, I really need to use some of the stuff that I have. I love the packaging on here. And I think I have a couple other things with the same packaging in here, but I really do like this packaging. So I'm gonna give this a try, see if I like it, see how it goes. Um, both of these products are brand new, so haven't touched these. So I wanna give this a shot. I am adding quite a bit more into this month because I found that last month I've got really bored very quickly with my fragrances. So I feel like if I add a lot of variety this rotation, I won't get as bored. So we do have quite a few that I'm adding in here. Another good one is something that I do also have to use up. And this is Beach Nights. So I really do like this fragrance. It's a really nice gourmand. It has toasted marshmallow, sea salt breeze, s'mores accord, beach driftwood, and creamy vanilla. But I do feel like because of the vanilla in here, she is going old really quickly. So really have to use her up as much as possible. So I think I've used her maybe a couple times so she's right up here. So, and then I also have the fragrance mist that I've used a couple times as well. This one I really do like, so it's gonna be very easy for me to use this up. I just wish I had more, but they did bring this back. This kind of reminds me as well as Bonfire Bash. So I'm gonna use that as like another summer transition shade, like scent into fall. So we also have another good fragrance. These are all just kind of like down in here. So this is a good one. This is coconut pineapple. This is another coconut that I will be adding into my collection. So because it was on its side, this is actually where I am at. So I have made quite a dent already on here. And then I also have a fragrance mist as well to go with it. This is shaved coconut, fresh pineapple, and sugar cane. Life's never been so sweet. So that's very fun. Another one, I do think I have another lotion of this, but in a different packaging when they relaunched this online as an online exclusive. So I really do like this. I have the shower gel actually in my shower right now for summer. So really do like that one. 
I would like to keep that in at least a rotation or two to just fully get as much use as I can. There's still a lot in here. This is quite a long video. So another one that I am using as like a transition scent is Endless Sea. So I actually did not use this last year. These are both gratis. So I did use some coupons for this. I really do like this fragrance. It kind of reminds me of Endless Weekend. So I feel like it's a good ending summer kind of fragrance. Um, it's very fresh, very clean. It's got fresh bergamot, saltwater lily, and ocean driftwood. So I really do like this one. This will be going in my collection. I don't want to fully use it up, but I would like to get some use on it. So same thing with this here. This is Poolside Cabana. I love the packaging on here, the straw. I do have a couple of these creams, so I would like to use this a little bit as well. This is Crisp Pear Warm Breeze in Solar Sandalwood. I really do like the packaging on here. This is just A plus packaging for me. Now they did come out with something similar to this Poolside Cabana this year, um, but I don't think they're the same at all. They did like home fragrance in it and I just, I don't know. I like this more than I like the other one. This is more limey and then the other one is just merry, like fresh-ish. So yeah, I really do like this one. Doesn't have any lime in it, but it does like indicate that there's lime. So yeah, I do like that one as well. All right, I have three more sets in here. So this is something that I would also try to get used up as much as possible. This is Mango Mai Tai and Golden Mango Lagoon. So I have Mango Mai Tai in the Fragrance Mist. I've had this for a couple years as well. This is Mango Nectar, Senquist Guava, and Sugar Cane. I think I got this in 2021. A little bit earlier than the other ones but yeah and then this is golden mango lagoon this is sunny mango saltwater woods and coral blooms and apparently i have another one of these i think i got this during like an mos sale so i bought more than just the one i've used it like once or twice but i am going to be bearing these together i think this would be like a really cute combination to very smell like Really delicious mango so I would like to try to get this used up as much as possible especially since the fragrance mist is probably getting a little bit older I don't know if everything's gonna fit this month so we also have this fragrance will be taking over for disco daydreams it is another really pretty purple this is called amethyst waves again I just want to at least make a dent on this fragrance I don't want to completely use it up, but this has dream berries, wild blooms, and soft sandalwood. So I think this is a really pretty fragrance. I love the packaging on here. So I would like to at least get this started. And then one last thing. This is actually something that I got this year, and I feel like it's a really pretty fragrance, and I'm really excited to use it. This is Tahiti Island dreams so i do have a backup lotion um but i'm gonna try to use up the cream first because they go bad more so this is fresh coconut water sparkling mandarin kiwi blossom lush fran frangipani and tahiti tah tahit tahitian <laughs> vanilla musk oh my goodness she's got a mouthful to her um but I'm really excited to try to use at least a little bit of this and get started on it. This is one of my favorites from the semi-annual sale that I hauled. But hopefully we can get some of these guys used up, started, and just have some fun with some of these. I'm really excited to try new things this month and put some of these to use. So, yeah. Let me know what you guys are putting in your project, what you guys finished from your last project, and what you guys are most excited for 
for your summer. So I feel like this month has a lot more in it compared to last month's. But I am almost finished being up some body cream. So that will definitely make some room in here. So yeah, thank you all so much for watching and I hope you guys enjoyed and I will see you guys in my next one. Bye.